Farquaad is dead, but our dreams are not. The collector is on the menu. So let's get this party started. I don't know that we... I don't know that we have anybody for the Timeless Woods here. Ah, uh, no. Moth did get, uh, did get some goods. Let's see. Oof. None of these are, none of these are great. This is also Moth's last. So Moth, hold on. Moth already has positive banter, crit, and damage. Okay, so... 5% death blow could be pretty clutch. It's between 5% death blow and uh, debuff resist. I think we'll go death blow. When all is lost, and then did anybody else... Nobody else got anything, but there is a conspicuous lack of a grave robber in here. So we're going to have to get that problem solved. So we're going to be doing comps that work well with a Grave Robber. I really, really liked that comp that we were running last time. And we're just going to start out with Denial. We're not going to, we're not going to be too fancy. Just going to try, we're going to do like a mini cycle, uh, hopefully to, to level up our Grave Robber and not kill anyone else in the process. The university's resources were impressive and yet it may be hamstringing our ability to find the collector on our first run, but they did patch in a higher occurrence rate of the collector. So I'm hoping that that means that we see them at least once during this. So yeah, so look at you. No memories, lady. Kind of like the vials. All right. So Audrey's going to need a name. Could we get in some good perks with you? Sunny disposition and head in the sand is not really what we're looking for, uh, if I'm being honest. So let's see, we could do like a, a full shuffle affair. We haven't brought Jarvis out in a while. That's that's the opposite of, uh, of, of a shuffle affair. Actually, oh no, shoot. I forgot to check to see if anyone didn't have first memories. I don't think I can check that here now. Hey, Rose. Ah, oh, shoot. That's that's actually that's a that's a misstep. I don't think I can go back now to check memories. Let's just take some people that it's it's likely we might have missed with. Good morning, Constantine. Puppy, puppy is okay. We haven't we haven't run a Hellion in a while, so let's let's give a Hellion a roll. There is emptiness. Let's give Innie a roll, and we know you're full. There's a possibility that uh, Black Curse hasn't, so we can we can go with something like this. I think this team is pretty is pretty solid. Rose, you want to be the grave robber? All right, I think we can. Uh, I think we can make that work. All right, illustrious. Thank you for hanging out and visiting. All right, let's let's go with these. We will. Uh, we'll see. Girl power, indeed. Girl power, indeed. All right. So we got Ravager, Orphan. You. Night Sworn is always the one that I kind of like lean towards. But I think let's let's go let's go dead eye this time. Has has less of a downside. Does it does harm our lunge, but gives us a little extra damage range. I can get down with that. Alright, let's let's get this party started. Famous last words, Constantine. Famous last words. So yes, let's uh, let's get the naming here. There we go. Welcome, welcome to the team, Rose. And let's see, we probably need to do some skills here. Since we went dead eye, we're probably gonna go.
probably gonna go with that. We might want something to be able to... We'll start with this. Just go for a ranged build. The winds whip more harshly on the far side of the brook. Actually, we should probably, we should probably check everybody's skills. No need to, uh... To go crazy here. Oh, we left you as an orphan. I don't love that. But I guess we can we can use her as a melee hero to move back and forth. So I, I guess it's not all bad. We'll try this. I, I don't love the orphan though. I forgot that that Inny was uh, was previously orphaning it up. What was that for? Four to six? All right, so we will do... We'll do that. Oh, good start. The slow suffering begins. So I'm I'm curious about the move back. I wanna I wanna play a bit with that. Not the best start, I'm not gonna lie. Right now we don't have a good We don't have a good way to remove winded, so we're gonna have to pick up toe to toe. To get that reset in there. Maybe we can farm some relationship just by repeatedly wailing on this guy. But so far we are we are slow to the party here. <laughs> I don't think I've ever gotten five stress on the first fight of the uh, of the festivities. That was unnecessary, but yeah, that was uh, that was definitely not a strong first fight. We also have the problem that we are potentially taking any to a librarian fight, which is always a little bit a uh, little bit messy. This team is not great for the librarian. I think Rose is the the best option, and our stress healing is a little bit a little bit iffy as well. It is safe here. Less max flame or some bleed resist. I think we'll probably do that. Undecided who gets the crit token. It is weird seeing all of the options here. The Ablative Powder is nice, if we are indeed going Librarian. So we'll do that. Yeah, they, they definitely do. This uh, this team is not, uh, not coming out of the gates swinging. I think we're probably going Shrieker. Do we have anything down here that we want to get? Of course, I could get the Shrine Map. The Dream. The Raven's Reach could be a decent pickup, but I think we just save our baubles. I don't think the Shrieker is going to make a big difference on such a short run, so I might just go Larval Carrion Eater. The healing is so good, especially on short runs, I think it's uh, it's the play. Now, let's see. Five Mastery is a big number. Everybody gets a little bit of love. Rockus is kind of our only stress heal, which is 
worrisome. We definitely need toe to toe. And then am I really going to take Raucous as a stress heal? Gumma Sham Sham Shabuga. You don't say, Josh. You don't say. I think Smokescreen is our last, our last pickup. Spend what you can. If you had asked me, I, I might not have, uh, I might not have guessed that, Josh. I think we'll go. We'll grab the adrenaline tonics, and then we're still sitting on a bit of stress. Yeah. Anything. Anything easy in the stress domain? Not really. Yeah, we may have to just uh, roll roll with the punches on this one. I think. I think I'm gonna put the, that on silver. Actually, <laughs> you just you just kind of hop into my chat from time to time, Josh, and you're you just you just say things like "gumma sham sham shabuga." That that makes sense. That makes sense. All right, let's let's get rolling. We don't have too much to worry about with this uh, with this first region, I reckon. Uh, let's see. You're our fastest, so you get those. You can take those. All right, we are looking for the collector. Welcome, Alex. Appreciate it as always. Every every number numbers, as it were. Oh, are we doing a librarian for our first fight? <laughs> first fight of the run? All right. Guess that's the way the cookie crumbles. We could also do a shambler right off the cuff. But... The game the game is not approaching us with a great deal of chill. But I think we're, uh, we're going to go here. The, uh, the benefits are just too great, even though Silver Eye is... Uh, Fast approaching stressed out. Nothing ever goes wrong when uh, I did upgrade Poison Dark. Good. Okay. All right. Pray for me. <laughs> we are uh, we are not we are not going slowly. That is for sure. We gotta go fast. I was gonna say that could be that could have been a kill. No uh no such luck, but Treasure Hunter, thank you for coming in and jinxing everything. I appreciate you. Oh yeah, we did get that upgraded, didn't we? Uh, let's see, I think... Ooh, the blind is nasty here. Let's just zap you. That's 42 damage. This one's 58, but we get a winded. All right, that's that's something. Do do love it when a plan comes together. Flashing dagger, poison dark, absinthe, dead of night, repartee. So Rose, I I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with my with my usual layout. Uh, but I, I do appreciate the, uh, the suggestion. Oh, that was not what I meant to do. Well, that was hilarious. <laughs> I forgot there's a pull associated with, uh, with that. I guess we, we learned in a most help, uh, in a, a least disastrous way, but that was, uh, that was exciting. Let's see. What's our what's our play here? This guy's a, a stress dealer. So the blind would have been nice. Famous last words. This is likely a kill. Yeah, let's let's do that. 
get some critting going here. I'm liking constant consecration of light on our uh, on our Ravager Hellion. Cause we get some we get some big numbers out of that. Struggling a bit with how this juggle comp is gonna work, because if I put Consecration of Light here, that doesn't that doesn't play well for us. Right, that gets the job done. Because what, ideally what you want is you want the person who's going first to be standing on the consecration so that you get that uh, so that you get that proc. So like as an example here, the way that I'm gonna play this next turn is I'm gonna get the proc off Consecration of Light with the Runaway, and then I'm gonna get a second one with the Hellion, assuming this guy lasts that long. Oh my gosh, Silver Eye went first. What the heck are the chances? Base speed four, base speed six. All right, well, I guess the answer is non-zero, but that was, uh, that was not great. Okay, so we pick up Foreclosure Notice. Snappy Swig and a Charred Litany. No Smoldering Hymnal, but that's that's okay. Assuming we survive. The conflagration must be stopped. You're going first this time, are you? Must be destroyed. Okay, we like that this book stack is small. I I should have uh, I should have probably toe to toed there, but we'll toe to toe once this book stack is gone. Measured. Which means we can move here. So we're potentially going to take some uncontrolled hits here. That's that's just the reality. But our Hellion is no longer going to have the ability to hit the back rank. So this is going to be this is going to be better. Oh, well, I don't like that very much. Our, our categorize right now is quite terrible. But this, the, the fact that we got a, uh, the fact that we got a reset on that is good. The, the resist there is kind of catastrophic. This is going to be a very fast, uh, a very fast run. Um, I'm, I'm a little concerned that the librarian is going to take things down very quickly here. Like we, yeah, I mean we get a lot of time in the front, which is good. The, the Ablet of Powder is doing insane work here. We have two turns, so we, we hang on for a second here. We really need to land some blights, though. This is getting a little spooky. Uh, this right here... The problem is this is hitting for 14. Wow. So 14 is okay. Uh, I would love to save these. Do I pass to save these? Tokens? I think I do. That's, that's a risky... That's a risky pass, but... I think we we really want the librarian's about to move forward and we really want big hits coming in. No, no worries at all, Rose. No worries at all. Uh, but I and I, I appreciate the, the thought for sure. Okay, smokestack there is is the best place for it. Taking the blind is fine. Ooh, the crit through that. And the crit and we still get the resist? Am I? I feel like I'm losing my mind here. Uh, let's see. So... I'm... If, if the Librarian adds a dodge, we may be in a very bad way. I hope so. I hope so, Rusty. 42 versus 24. Alright, we will do it that way. 
I'm glad I saved those, but we got another crit anyways, so it was less, uh, less impactful. I forgot to add Ablative Powder here. And then I think we've, we've got the kill, so I'm not going to bother using the other Ablative. All right. Just just bad luck on, on resists, I, I think, is all Rose. All right. Well, we, we got ourselves a snappy swig. Are you fast enough to make it work? No, not until we hit the Watchtower. When we hit the Watchtower, that will get better. Slightly, slightly dangerous there. Charred Litany here is good. Put those there and that there. So once we hit the watchtower, we will uh, we'll be a little better off. I don't love where our stress is right now. Good job dodging that, though. So let's see. You're going to kill this guy. So you're going to do work on this one. So when I said kill, I meant uh, I meant fail to kill. We'll, we'll take him out that way. I don't really want to take the crit if I can avoid it. Don't love, don't love that stun. Our novice grave robber is doing some work for sure. I think I'm going to I'm going to try and slow roll killing this guy just a tiny bit even though we're probably going to take some stress cuz this is a good a good opportunity to just get a bit of regen popping cuz we have the larval carrion eater so good opportunity to get some heals going here what are the chances that we just get a uh, glint in the dark not really going to do it for us unfortunately I'm thinking maybe with the with the goods we could make something work there, but they both these two both already have a crit, so let's put one there. Just trying to get a bit of stress healing here. I know we're we're taking a hit here, but oh, the corpse going away is so unfortunate. That shouldn't get the kill, but it should do a bit of stress healing. And then we'll finish up here. No stress heal. So we we traded one for one there, stress healing wise. Nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Alright, we do we do have a little bit of money, so we'll be able to get rid of Head in the Sand on Rose. And maybe maybe clean up a few other things. She understands the futility of her work, but undertakes it nonetheless. Tuckered out is a little annoying. But it's not too bad. Head in the sand. Do you see those two switch there? I wonder when that's gonna get. Nervous Tippler, the hard stuff. Okay, so, Pyrophobic, I, I kind of want to get rid of all of these. I do like Rummager. I don't think it's worth locking Rummager in, but this isn't going to be a huge deal moving forward, but... I'll get rid of Coward. I'll get rid of, of Pyrophobic, I think. I'm going to leave the Tuckers out. They're not terrible. Because I'll pick up two more healing solves and then... I think that's about 
it. We could pick up some clarifying pulses against the boss. I'm not super worried about the boss though. Uh, that may be that may be hubris, but pick up some loathing, then we'll get the watchtower, which will activate Snappy Swig. The loathing whispers. Yeah, if we get our turn order right, I think we can do very good things, but. I kind of want to do the Hoarder if I can swing it. That means picking up two Loathing and then we get two minus Loathing. We have a Shambler altar here. Hard to say no to fighting a Shambler, isn't it? Yeah, let's, let's fight a Shambler. What could possibly go wrong? At least it should be. This this area has offered us not one but two shamblers. Who are you? You and Silver Eye are doing pretty well. So we'll do that. Yeah, more, uh, how many, how many times have you seen the Shambler at this point, Rusty? Are you just like, are you just drowning in Shamblers? Okay, so she is, she's dead next turn. That's all good. Love the combo here. Increases our damage nicely. That's gonna make our that's gonna make us juggling a little tricky to work out. Okay, that was a that was a cheeky hit there. Take the crit when we can get it. Twenty two damage on that head. Oops. Nothing, nothing to sneeze at. That was, that was a weak sauce hit, I will say. Get a little bit of potential stress healing. I think we I think we just finish up here. Uh Orphan again, Bray. I I I don't know why I keep playing Orphan Runaway, but the spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. But here we are, and I'm doing it. Let's see. Do we even like Enlightened Element here? I think we I think we pair Enlightened Element. Do we like foreclosure notice? If rank four. Maybe we swap you two and do that. We can probably put that there. You are rocking eight speed, yes. Okay, and then for now, a little bit of fire resist is not the end of the world. Uh, let's see, do we have... Is it not? Combo is nice to be able to remove, so we'll swap that in for that. And we'll head off to the right here. prepared for the upcoming obstruction? Is my coach prepared for the upcoming obstruction? Yes, it is It is full of fighters. Excellent work. Take the crits where we can get them. 11 fire on that. Woo! Spicy.
We're probably going to take a front mortar here. But it won't be the lethal front mortars of yore that we've had to deal with. I was hoping to get the kill on that. Uh, the slow suffering begins. But we'll just we'll get the heal up. We'll get the crit token. We'll avoid future front mortars. These guys have been the bane of my existence as of late. Should have definitely aimed for him because we would have gotten the guarded sorted out. But Snappy Swig be doing Snappy Swig things. And our Orphan is doing some, doing some work, for sure. Gosh, she is really not clutching the corpses. Get rid of that. Get a bit of a heal off. All right. Not terrible. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. So as far as as far as uh, memories for Rose that we're looking for, we're uh, we're definitely in the market for a toy. Assuming she doesn't die during this. Uh, this Shambler fight seems. What's what's your deal? You are ten and ten. You're at eleven. I guess I guess we do this way. But these two are just not agreeing. We need more riches. I'm doing everything I can, treasure, to hunt treasure, as it were. The treasure must be hunted. Six to thirteen. This could be a kill. Eh, let's let's start out this way. The crit machine back there. An unavoidable end. Gosh, for all the critting that she is doing, we are not seeing the uh, we're not seeing the payoff. Good disease resist, at least. Let's see, you're not quite dead, so let's just eliminate you. Grape Rubber's doing a good job managing her own stress, if nothing else. That was a misclick. Huge misclick, actually. I didn't even I was aiming for this guy. But at this point we'll just zap that. Have you heard of Zelda on C D? It's an ancient N9N Canon Trio of Games on CD has lots of memes. No, that is not uh, not something that I have heard of before. Treasure. The one pleasant in the extreme. This work is noble. We have no need for distracting dust. Necessary. The loathing whispers. All right, and Shambler Ho. What could possibly go wrong? Up ahead, the seat of our regrettable research. The uh, the obvious answer to what could possibly go wrong is we have a pretty nasty case of not being super great with shuffles.
Not the hit we needed there. A promising development. All right, I will. I will do that. I will do that. What uh? What arrow was this? Uh, was this? This cursed uh, Zelda on CD. Ooh, that was a low percentage chance of uh, of missing that one. Let's just yank you forward, maybe. Was this a uh, like PlayStation era? Since it's C since we're talking about a CD, PS One era type of thing. Gosh, she's critting like uh, like it's going out of style. Okay, natural swing is locked in. Makes that less surprising. Low rolling on the Vesta like it's going out of style. We'll definitely cauterize here. A simple variable. Easily resolved. I, I really wish that there was an alchemist style path for the uh, for the grave robber. I know that's that's probably indicative of the fact that I am over reliant on on her blight ability, but get the heal up there, and then I think we just Axia. Might as well use the big one. The past is gone. Okay. Don't mind picking up the mastery. I think that might be our first mastery for the region. No, we're sitting on three. Not bad. Okay. We'll, we'll hopefully get one more from the Shambler altar. Anti-Venom, we, we're doing pretty well on lots of heals, so I think we stick with... Reads, the Sacrifice of Hope opens the gate to ruin. The Sacrifice of Hope. Offer up yourself if you crave the void. Offer up yourself if you crave the void. Interesting. That's a, that's a, that's a line I haven't seen previously, but here we go. The walker from beyond the stars. A shambling horror. It's not a bad start. I don't have a great way to get off the front line here, though. So this will be this will be a little interesting, but. That's, well, that's going to solve some of our ordering problems. Couldn't say no to that. Just got to start getting the, uh... So the problem is you can move, so... So we'll just get that going and then start putting some work in on these wrigglers. Three to five is not enough. Well, I guess we do that to at least get it close. The combo means that we're getting some heals there. Not a lot we could have done about that. And this guy becomes a lot harder to kill when he's in the back, unfortunately. Ooh, very fast, very fast Shambler turn there, unfortunately. Okay, still locked in place, which means I still can't use... Still can't use Backdraft, which has been really a pain for me. 
Oh, I'm locking her in place again. That's a that's a mistake. I I should have let the let the immobilize drop. At this point, you two are staying where you are. Let me do that. 50-50? Alright. You're locked in place at least, so... Let's just do that. It's not a great, not a great Shambler fight by any stretch of the imagination, but this guy's gonna hit pretty hard too. Steady yourself. Really? Whoa! Self-reliance is a rare and wonderful thing. Jeez, that was unnecessarily close. Why can't I Divine Grace? Are you seriously above 30%? Jeez. Insane. Oh boy. Yeah, that was indeed close. Eyes of the Void. Is this the one where we do it? Yeah, I... The, the number of times that we've had, like, nasty crits straight into, uh, straight into pain is... Uh, is non-zero. We might be able to do something with Black Curse there. We'll put that there for extra bleed resist. I think I need to find a way to get Raucous on the uh, on the bar. But yeah, we have we have had some some nastiness. Please no meltdown. If we can just get into the next fight, that would be amazing. Any just hang in there. Okay, so we got to get any off the front line, because these two ladies, they're, uh, they're problematic. Well, so much for getting off the, the front line. Uh, no, this is, we're just doing a quick, uh... We're just doing a quick denial run to start out, and then we're going to go into some bigger stuff. Just hang in there, alright? I was going for the crit here for, for, uh... Okay, the blind is okay. We're we're not we're no longer gonna get you off the front line, unfortunately. Oh, that stress from nervous. We're flirting with a meltdown in a big way. Everybody's blind too. Gotta love that. Miss the crit feels bad. That's a meltdown. Man. It's gonna be bad for relationships, that's for sure. There remains a foothold out of that, that may be the least of our worries, though, with the with the current setup we got going on here. No, no, the runaway is having a bad time. I mean, we are just having a bad time, is, is really what I should say here. Alright, that's that's merciful at least. She won't get a chance to use that. I decided to go for this one because we, we don't need to spend the combo. Oh my gosh, get off of us. Holy cow. She's wearing double bleed resist trinkets as a reminder.
Just, I, I want to get her off the front line so that we're not taking any more abuse than we have to here. I'm just going to go for the rush down here. Not. Oh. <laughs> uh, the game knows how to get you sometimes. So if you do that, who else has healing? You have healing? All right. So we'll do we'll do that to try and rebuild some relationship. Into that. May yet arrest this collapse. And then I think seven for one. I mean, this will this will get us a weakness. So I'll do that. Oh, you got nothing you can do? I guess you're... No, nah, I think we move forward here. Looks looks a little weird, but... They're just... They're going for seconds on Meltdown, it appears. Let's just, let's just get the healing we can get here. Dance around a bit. The, the idol is dead. Hitting for one. Oh, I guess you are winded, aren't you? We still applied eight burn with our blind. That's uh that's something. I'm trying to soften this up so that hopefully we can get the kill with our Hellion. Can you actually clutch a corpse? Oh my word, one off and now it goes away. I'm just trying to get a heal here. It's uh, it's proving easier said than done. All right, if you don't kill this, you're fired. All right. Hey, Moth, how's it going? get out of there. Whew. This was not a very smooth first region. Let it die. Not a very smooth first region. Stun resist on the trinket isn't terrible. But uh, six mastery is a lot. That should that should carry us pretty hard. But we're gonna have we got relationship problems that that need sorting out. So we're hoping we see some songbooks of touching dirges in order to kind of right the ship. Don't think clandestine cape is getting used. Rest now. Yeah, I decided to mix mix things up. Ooh, all positives. What are the chances? Could pick up a bounty hunter. We don't do that very often either. For wealth no longer has meaning. If indeed it a lot of did. trinkets on offer. A serious lack of relationship building. Oh, who has? Uh oh. Okay, it's you who. Yeah, so you and Innie can't use that, but... Right the ship. <laughs> hey, Dariak. Let's see. 
So we can pick up these, but we can't use them on the Vestal. I think I'm I think I'm spending my money here to try and get our relationships as good as we can get them. Should be like whiskey bottle, these two, and those two. Okay, so let's see. So, worst relationships are you and Silver Eye can take one of these. Okay, awesome. That was a 20%. Okay, the plus three helps though. Does the plus three, that gets you to nine, which gets you to 0% for the negative. Now we need to work on you and Black Curse. Okay, fantastic. Now I, I understand the game's plan. Yep. I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna have to deal with that. Let's see. So we could do we could roll the dice on some 75s to try and get that improved. We only get two of them. We also don't have great items for taking out the general. So I'll buy this. And this. And we're just gonna, we're gonna accept that our relationships need some work. Experience. That is a, that is a, a kind understatement if I, if I do say so myself. Let's get this. Because we don't have a great team for pushing back the growth either. Uh, I didn't see anything that caught my eye, if I'm being honest. Yeah, nothing. The buttressing band is okay, but I think we I think we save our baubles for uh, for greener pastures, and yeah, not great on the. Uh... Not great on the food front either. Planning and mindfulness as vital to survive. Chance to produce restorative is nice. But we're headed into the tangle. We're gonna try and take out the general, but resignation. Uh we're we are a bit on the struggle bus. We could hire the bounty hunter, but I think we're better off going this way. Did I I should have really upgraded Rocka's Revelry. That was uh that was a big mess. On the uh, on the mastery, but all right, no negative relationships. 